One year, that's how long a mother has been waiting for answers in her son's unsolved homicide case. 21 year old Sean Hankins was shot and killed a year ago today in Petersburg. And tonight we're hearing from his mother who is pushing for justice. Eight news reporter Cheyenne Pagan has been following this story and she joins us live in front of the Petersburg Police Department with the latest on the investigation, Cheyenne. Eric, I spoke with Petersburg police today and they told me there are no new updates they can share in Sean's case. It's a reality his mother has had to face every day. It's just not fair. He didn't deserve this. A grieving mother holding back tears as she speaks about her son, Sean Hankins, who was shot and killed in Petersburg one year ago today. Donna Guernsey says her son's body was found behind St. Paul's Baptist Church in the city just before 2 a.m. Somebody shot him in his head. He was unarmed and somebody shot him and left him here. A couple of months after his death, Guernsey told 8 News that items from a memorial that was put behind the church to honor his life started disappearing. He loved the color blue. Since then, she says they've been able to rebuild and it's now flourishing with flowers, crosses and his picture. I had to put Apple air tags in the solar roses because they kept getting stolen. Um, that problem's been solved and we've been to court over that, thankfully. And even though she got answers there, she says she's not heard anything from authorities about who's responsible for her son's death. Now, after 365 days of what this mother calls a, quote, nightmare, she has this plea to police. You need to do your job and stop another family from going through this. I want justice for my son. I want answers. And I want to prevent other people from going through this because it's not. This isn't how life is supposed to be. If you have any information about this case, you're asked to contact police. Live in Petersburg, Cheyenne Pagan, 8 News.